Hey coders, welcome back to the channel. My name is Harish Kumar. Today I have got something super exciting to share with you. We are diving into a brand new VS Code extension that will take your coding efficiency to the next level. We all know the struggle of forgetting that perfect function or that essential bit of syntax. Well, those days are over. Let me introduce you to Control Alt Cheat, the ultimate VS Code extension that puts a massive collection of cheat sheets right at your fingertips. Before we dive in, I want to take a moment to thank all of you for the incredible support I have received for my previous extension Spec Coder AI. Your feedback has been amazing and it's motivated us to create even more tools to enhance your coding experience. If you haven't tried Spec Coder AI yet, you are missing out. It's a powerful AI powered coding assistant that can help you write better code faster. Be sure to check out my previous video on Spec Coder AI for a more in-depth look. The link is in the video description. Now let's talk about our new VS Code extension. In this Control Alt Cheat VS Code extension with over 61 plus cheat sheets currently available, you will have instant access to syntax, functions, commands and more covering a wide range of languages and frameworks. For example, PHP, JavaScript, Vue, React, Laravel, Docker, MySQL, Postgres, Tailwind CSS, Bootstrap, CHMOD, C++, Python, Curl, and so much more. And the best part, Control Alt Cheat is constantly evolving. We are committed to add even more cheat sheets to the collection in the future. The Control Alt Cheat VS Code extension isn't just a static collection of cheat sheets. It's packed with features to make your life easier. Now let's install this VS Code extension and explore its feature. So now in the editor, let's click on this extension icon to open the VS Code extension marketplace. And in the search field, let's look for the extension Control Alt Cheat. Here is the extension that we are looking for. Click on it and click on this install button to install this extension in the VS Code editor. It is installed. Now in the corner, you can see a cheat sheet icon right here. Clicking on this icon, it will open cheat sheet panel. Alternatively, you can press Ctrl Alt C on your keyboard to open the cheat sheet panel. Or if you are a Mac user, you can press Command Alt C. In this cheat sheet panel, you can see the Tailwind CSS cheat sheet. And these are the cheat codes. Let's click on this. And this is the border radius cheat codes for Tailwind CSS. Using this input field, we can search for the specific Tailwind utility classes. For example, let's search for BG Gray. And here is the result it has found. All the BG Gray classes. This is the utility class. And this is the CSS property will apply using this class. When clicked on it, this utility class is copied to the clipboard for use in our project. Let's clear this. In this drop down, you can find a long list of available cheat sheets. As of now, there are 61 plus cheat sheets and the Control Alt Cheat extension is continuously growing. We are committed to adding even more cheat sheets in the future. The Tailwind is currently selected cheat sheet. We can switch to other cheat sheets. For example, let's select for Bootstrap 4. Now we have an extensive list of Bootstrap 4 snippets. If I click on this cheat code, here is the snippet code and this is the preview of this code. From this button, we can copy this and use it in our project. And we can search for the Bootstrap classes using this search input field. Similarly, let's select for Vue.js2. It now displays the snippet list for Vue.js2. The other cheat sheets are restricted and only accessible to premium users. Now let's enter the license key 
to unlock the full potential of this extension. So let's click on this enter license key. You can find your license key at this URL and then paste your license key in this input field and press enter. License key is activated. Now reload the editor. Now press Ctrl Alt C or Command Alt C for Mac user to open the cheat sheet panel. Now the premium features are unlocked. Now we can access all available cheat sheet from this drop down menu. So for example, let's search for Laravel, this one, select this. Here we have access to comprehensive list of Laravel snippets. These include snippets for eloquent relationships, helper methods, routing and more. Click on this snippet to reveal the code and we can copy it from here to use it in our project. And from this input field, we can search for specific snippet. Simply type in what you are looking for and the extension will quickly find it within the selected cheat sheet. Once you found it, just click to copy the code and use it in your project. So let's search for has many relationship. These are the result it has found. Click on the relevant snippet to reveal the code and we can copy this code from here and use it in our project. How cool is that? Now let's look for the another cheat sheet called CH mode. So from this drop down, let's search for CH mode. This one, let's select this. This cheat sheet provides quick reference commands for managing file permissions in Unix and Linux system. Additionally, there is a CH mode generator that allows you to quickly and visually generate permissions in numerical and symbolic form. For example, in this input field, if I type 755, this is the symbolic permission reference is displayed and the corresponding checkboxes are updated. You can also generate permissions by selecting, deselecting these checkboxes. For instance, unchecking these certain checkboxes can change the permission to 700. It is pretty cool, right? Let's open the another cheat sheet for jQuery. So in this drop down, let's search for jQuery and select this one. This cheat sheet provides a quick reference for various jQuery code snippets, syntax and examples, including selectors, DOM manipulation, events, effects, ejects and more. These days, many developers are transitioning away from jQuery to other JavaScript frameworks. If you are also considering moving to vanilla JavaScript from jQuery, there is a cheat sheet for jQuery alternatives. Let's see this. So here is the jQuery alternative cheat sheets. It contains core snippets for achieving the same result as jQuery using pure JavaScript. For example, if we search for add class, here is the result it has found. Click to reveal the code and it shows the syntax for adding class in jQuery and how we can do it in pure JavaScript. Let's close this. Similarly, let's search for fade out. Here we get the result. Let's open this. This repeat code shows how to use the fade out effect in jQuery and this code explains how to achieve the same effect in pure JavaScript by toggling classes and adding these CSS properties. Let's look at another example. So let's search for parse JSON. This is the result we got. Let's open this. This is the syntax in jQuery and this is how we can use it in pure JavaScript. Now let's take a look at another cheat sheet moment js so let's search for moment this one let's open this moment js is widely used library for working with dates this cheat sheet contains many moment js snippet code for quick reference such as parsing formatting date manipulations like adding subtracting modifying dates and more although moment js is powerful and widely used it's worthwhile to explore modern alternatives. So let's open the moment.js alternative cheat sheets. So in this drop down, here is the moment.js alternatives. Let's open this. 
This cheat sheet covers how to implement Moment.js functionalities in other libraries such as native JavaScript, DateFNS, DayJS, Lexon, and Temporal. For example, let's open this code snippet. This code snippet demonstrates how to add specified number of days to a given date using Moment.js. Using this code, we can implement this in native JavaScript and also with DateFNS, which is a modular library for functional date manipulation. Similarly, we can implement this using DayJS, a lightweight alternative to Moment.js. And this is the Lexon example, a modern library with immutable date objects. And this is the temporal example, a newer ECMAScript proposal for date time handling. Choosing right library for your date and time needs depends on your project's requirements, performance considerations, and personal preferences. Control Alt Cheat provides a comprehensive cheat sheet to assist you with this decision. Let's close this and let's explore another cheat sheet, SSH, this one. This cheat sheet provides a quick reference for various SSH commands and usage tips. SSH acts as a secure tunnel that allows you to access a server or other computer from your own system. Its main uses includes logging into a server from your computer, safely sending files between computers, controlling a remote machine as if it's right in front of you. This cheat sheet will greatly assist you in your daily SSH workflow. For example, it includes command for connecting server as well as generating SSH keygen. Additionally, it explains how to execute a command on the remote machine and how to run a local script on the remote machine. It also provides a list of SCP commands. SCP means secure copy. It covers the commands for copying files from a remote machine to your local machine as well as the command for copying files between two servers and other more useful commands. These commands and tips are designed to simplify your daily workflow and make your life easier. Let's open another cheat sheet for Git. We use Git in our daily life workflow, so it is very important. The Git cheat sheet would be very handy resource for you. So let's search for Git in this drop down. We have cheat sheets for Git, Git tricks, Git revisions. Let's start with this Git cheat sheet. It includes essential and common used Git commands such as creating repository, making changes, Git configurations, and many other useful commands. This Git trick cheat sheet offers handy shortcuts and advanced techniques like refs, cherry picking, and many other useful commands. Next is this Git revisions. This Git revision cheat sheet focuses on navigating through your project's history. In this Control Alt Cheat tool, you have access to various cheat sheets like Docker, Curl, Bash Scripting, PHP, Livewire, MySQL, Postgres, Python, and so much more, which can greatly assist you in your coding. And you know what? That's not all as control alt sheet also allow you to create your own custom cheat sheets. You can add new cheats, edit existing ones and delete cheats you no longer need. This tool is all about making it work for you. Let's explore this feature also. Now so to create new cheat sheet simply click on this plus button. Here we have model to create a new cheat sheet. In this name input field Type the name of your cheat sheet. For example, let's say our cheat sheet name is My Snippets. This description field is optional. Afterward, click the Save button to create new My Snippets cheat sheet. It is created. Now to add snippet code, first we need to create a cheat category. So click this plus button and here we have model with new category form in the title field. Type the category name. Let's say category name is Laravel. Adding this documentation URL is optional. And next 
click the save button to create this category. Our Laravel category is created. Within the category you can add your cheat or snippet code. Click this plus button to add new snippet code. Here is the model with new cheat form in the title input field. Let's type the snippet title. Let's say our snippet title is upload file. This documentation URL is optional. In this description field we can paste our snippet code. So let's paste our snippet code. Next select all this code and click this button to add markdown code and here let's change it to PHP because this snippet is in PHP. Next this is the preview image URL which is optional. Next we have this button to add table content. For this snippet we do not need any table content so we can skip this. I'll show you this in the next example. Click the save button to save this snippet. And here we go upload file snippet is created. Click on this to reveal the code and from this button we can copy this code and use it in our project. It is so cool right? Let's see another example. Suppose we want to create a snippet that has list of Laravel helper methods. So to start click on this plus icon and in this title input field let's say our snippet title is Laravel helper methods. Next this documentation URL is optional and here we want to add table content. Because we are going to add this table content in that case this description field is optional. And for this columns specify the number of columns you need. In our case we need two. And next in this input field we will add the helper method name and in this input field we will type the purpose of the helper method. So let's say our helper method is action and its purpose is to generate a URL for the given controller action. Next uh, click add row to continue adding more rows and in this input field let's say our helper method is route and its purpose is to generate a URL for a given named route. You can continue adding more helper methods but for our demo this should be enough. Next click the save button to save this snippet. Now the new helper method cheat code is created. Click to reveal the code and here is how the table content looks. You can create as many cheat sheets and snippets you need. There are no limits. With the help of the control alt cheat vs code extension you can boost your productivity. No more wasting time searching online for cheat sheets. Find what you need instantly within your vs code environment. It will also reduce errors as you will get the syntax right every time with a reliable reference at your fingertips. And you can also level up your skills by exploring new languages and frameworks with ease access to their cheat sheets. We are constantly looking for ways to enhance control alt cheat tool. If you have any suggestions for new cheat sheets or features please feel free to create an issue on our github repository right here. To celebrate the launch we are offering a special discount. Use the coupon code first launch at checkout and get 50% off on control alt cheat tool. Additionally you will also receive a 50% discount on the spec coder AI vs code extension at the checkout. Go ahead and install control alt cheat today. Take control of your coding workflow, level up your skills and say goodbye to those frustrating coding roadblocks. Thanks for joining me. If you found this video helpful, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more awesome coding content. Let us know in the comments below what kind of cheat sheets you would love to see added in the future. Until next time, happy coding. Mm -hmm.